Bring Governor Christie in here because we're talking about national debt climbing towards $19 trillion, Governor. Our federal government employs nearly 3 million workers. Our tax code is more than 74,000 pages long. If you're elected president, Governor Christie, what concrete steps would you take to reduce the size of the federal government? First off, let me, let me just say this in, in response to this back and forth. For the people who are out there right now, I want to guarantee you one thing, real clearly. If you think that Mike Huckabee won't be the kind of president who will cut back spending or Chris Christie or John Kasich, wait till you see what Hillary Clinton will do to this country and how she will drown us in debt. She is the real adversary tonight, and we better stay focused as Republicans on her. Now, I put, forward, I put forward an entitlement reform plan. We spend 71 cents of every dollar in America on entitlements and debt service. Mm -hmm. And it, you know, Willie Sutton used to say, when they asked him why he robbed banks, he said, that's because where it's where the money is. Okay? And where the money is in the federal government are these entitlement programs and debt service. What I've said is we need to get a hold of that. We cannot continue to go down the $19 trillion in debt. And so our plan will save over $1 trillion over the next 10 years and make sure that Social Security and Medicare are there for those who truly need it and also make sure that we have money to be able to reduce taxes and spend on the things we need to spend. I will also, on my first day as, as president, sign an executive order that says no more regulation for the next 120 days by any government agency or department. We are drowning in regulation. Stop, and then we'll go out there and we'll cut and reduce regulation that small business owners across this country want us to do. You'll grow the economy then. More money will come into the system, and we'll get more closer to balance. But the bottom line is, believe me, Hillary Clinton's coming for your wallet, everybody. Don't worry about Huckabee or Jindal. Worry about her.